Greetings everyone. In this video, I want to talk about how you can work through things that you are uh, being your own sounding board. Greetings. This infinite source truth is made possible by the generous contributions and support of viewers like you. Please consider making a contribution now. Thank you. Some of you may have a time in which you are alone and you need a sounding board and how you can be your own sounding board. Now, I suggest that you get a, use your cell phone or a mini recorder to record yourself as if you were talking to someone else about whatever it is that you're needing clarity on. Now, you could even use your cell phone to videotape yourself as if you were talking to someone and you will see and observe your emotions and your mannerisms as you're talking. And then play it back to yourself and listen to yourself. At times you may find that the key to your problem, solution, whatever it is, is in listening to yourself. Now, you can write things down. You can sleep on it and then listen to yourself the next day when your change when you have changed it's new day and listening to what you had put in audio video or on paper now some things are as simple as now if you're talking about um, a relationship if you're talking about moving if you're talking whatever it is that's you feel like you need better comprehension of the bigger picture. Working through things this way will reveal things to yourself that you would not pick up in any other way. If you do a video and as you're doing the video you are acting and talking as if there's someone is sitting across the table from you and you think of the questions that they would ask you. All right, if you go to a counseling session, mostly what a counselor does is sit and listen. Occasionally they will ask you a question to dig deeper into what it is that you're thinking. If you do an audio or a videotape and then you listen to it as if it were not you, but it was somebody else, you will hear and you'll think of questions that you would ask that person in that state of mind and being. And you can work through a lot of issues this way. Sometimes you need a benefit and not beneficial. You know, people like to put down on a sheet of paper, fold it in half and put the positives on the one side and the negatives on the other and see if there are more positives that outweigh the negatives, but sometimes some of the positives are worth way more than the negatives. But this is just another way that you can assist yourself in growth. Now, you need to have privacy. All right. If it's on your cell phone and your cell phone has a lock and nobody else is going to be listening to your personal stuff, that's great. If you are writing things down and or typing it into your computer on a page and your computer is password protected, that's great. But this is for you and you alone, not to be shared. Because if you are sharing it, well, then you have someone to bounce things off of. But sometimes you need to bounce them off yourself before you go someplace else. And then it can cause you to ask questions, 
Think of questions to ask your source self to get to a deeper level of knowing yourself and ways of making decisions. So this is just an idea for you to possibly use and you may find it to be of a benefit to you. You really can do this. You can really know yourself and make the best choices for you in your life path. Now, if you find the information and the work that I've done in the matrix to be of benefit to you, then it benefits you to say thank you with a gift via PayPal. The link is in the description box below. Abundance, health, and prosperity to you.